we're Jack and Megan. In late 2020, we packed our lives into our tiny home on wheels and traveled across our home country of Australia. We decided we loved living in our troopy so much that what was originally meant to be a 12 month trip turned into almost three years. We recently made the big decision to part with our beloved home on wheels. This is it, this has been our home, an adventure of a lifetime. Are you gonna cry? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am crying. So that we could start a new adventure. We have no idea what we're in for, but subscribe to join us on the journey. Good morning, everyone from Kintamani. Good morning, everyone. In Bali, if you missed last episode, probably should fill you in. We're in Bali. And we're living in a van. We're on a little <laughs> van adventure all around Bali for one more night we've got in this van. So we're going to try and pack in as much as possible. But we're catching up on a bit of sleep last episode. So we're sorry we weren't too informative about where we are. So this place is called Le Monte Sunrise Campground. Look at it. It cost us $10 to stay for the night. They got toilets and showers and that is Mount Batur right behind us and we had this amazing sunrise over here this morning. So guys, it's the best. It's been great. And we managed to find some gas and groceries yesterday. And we're so making coffees. We can actually live the proper van life vibes. Look at this, this morning. Ready? So we bought a white coffee which I'm guessing already has its milk mixed in. Yeah, look what it comes with on the back. Milk powder. A little choc topping. Cute. Breakfast is served, guys. So tropical. So we found our, our new favorite fruit. I don't know if you can see that on camera. It's called a dragon fruit. And it it literally dyes your hands purple. And Jack's pants are ruined. My shorts are gone. So we've got mango, dragon fruit, and pineapple today. Coffee. Also found these little granola bites as well. The coffee is so sweet. Mm -hmm. It's like really not good for me, I think. We could have got you know, just a normal instant coffee you get in Australia, but it was $7, whereas a whole pack of this was like 30 cents. So mm. we just went for this. So today's plan is to make it over to the beach. And not get purple hands. To camp tonight, but yep. hopefully see as much as we can in the meantime, because yesterday and the day before, we sort of just spent the whole time driving, which was amazing because there's just so much to see. Taking it all in, drives. but still like... Yeah processing what is going on yeah but hopefully today we can do a bit more adventuring on the way to our next camp yeah we want to mainly see today hopefully a waterfall mm -hmm. our first indonesian waterfall and we want to try and eat some local food mm -hmm. and try and top this yeah because it's pretty good funny how we just in like a little quiet mountain village and we've just been weaving through basically a rainforest and now we're back in the chaos of and traffic just of, like that yeah it's crazy but then what it is is there's you'll come through towns then it'll go remote again then it'll come through another town with thousands and thousands of people it's pretty cool hey it's wicked there's so much going on we got a 47 minute drive so to the waterfall but and it, then I think total today is about three hours. But it will probably take like two hours to yeah. get to the waterfall. <laughs> Made it to the waterfall. It's called Krisik Waterfall, and I think it's not a very well-known one. It's one I just found on Google Maps. Just yep. searched waterfall, and then just saw what was on our route on the way to the campsite. And so. apparently not very touristy. And on another note, check out these Land Rovers. How good are these? <laughs> yeah, not very touristy. So let's see how we go. We've got some guides up here apparently that we got to pay twenty thousand to. So let's see what they say. Hello. Oh, the waterfall down here. Waterfall? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
One ticket. Yes. Two okay. tickets. Thank you. Thank you. Hello from the future. I'm very sorry to interrupt the vlog and it's just about to get really good too, but this is also really, really good. We want to say a big thank you to the sponsor of today's video, which is AG1. And Jack and I are way too excited about this one because we've been drinking this stuff all year and we love it. If you've never heard of AG1 before, it is an all-in-one nutritional drink, which with just one scoop has up to nine health products in one, including a multivitamin, minerals, probiotics, and more. So we are living out of two suitcases and two backpacks for the next six months, but we made sure that we brought a whole lot of these travel packs and we've even got a big a big boy bag as well so like you probably heard jack say heaps of times already in the first two videos of this series that we're going to be eating all of the food over here in asia so what's great about this is now we have that peace of mind that we're hitting all of our nutritional needs throughout the day with one drink it's suggested that you drink this first thing in the morning as a little morning routine personally jack and i usually have it in the afternoon for a little energy boost and pick me up in the afternoon. Since we have been drinking this, that is one of the main things that we've noticed is we do have a lot more energy throughout the day, which is great. It also includes a whole heap of ingredients that support brain health. And if you've been watching Jack and I for long enough, you probably know we need all the help that we can get with that. Wash wounds and, oh, irrigate, irrigating eyes. What, uh, what am I even talking about? I don't even know. Anyway, we're gonna go get some lunch. We found this little Vietnamese did say I say it wrong? No, you did not say it wrong. Right. <laughs> Vietnamese. You said it wrong. Oh. So whether you're traveling or not, the convenience of AG1 is hard to beat. With just one scoop once a day, you're helping to support your gut health, immunity, energy, and brain health. We've already gotten all of our family and friends onto this stuff, so we're so excited to share it with you guys as well. And AG1 have given us a little offer. If you use the link in our description below, you can get a year's supply of the vitamin D3 and K2 drops and five travel packs for free as well. So go check it out. Your health will thank you. Let's get back to the vlog. Oh, well, we got our uh, bamboo sticks. How much was that? It was uh, 40,000 repairs, so what's that in our? Uh, four dollars? Four bucks to uh, get some bamboo sticks and head down. And already it is, it's amazing. So tropical. It's, the humidity is next level. We've already seen lizards, all kinds of ants and all kinds of bugs. Megan. On hey. the, I was reading the sign on the way in and apparently this waterfall flows year round even when they're having a drought. Really? Mm -hmm. Look at that. So there's actually two waterfalls here and we're just making our way really deep down into the rainforest right now, which we haven't done for a very long time. We've been all through <laughs> Queensland in Australia and all the tropical forests there. Well, what this is sort of reminding this, me of is border ranges. Um, yeah, but it's just in, different. Yeah, like, I mean, there's a lot more bamboo again. and stuff. We're going to go to the second waterfall first because I think we just passed oh, you're making, where you we turn have, off to the first one. We've got to walk in the river. Oh, cool. How cool is that? <laughs> it's wicked. Wait till you see this, guys. Megan's gone ahead and she, she's too scared to go any further. Look at this. We're going into a cave. Oh, my goodness. Next level. This is next level. Look where we're going. This is awesome. We're currently walking over a bamboo stick bridge. Look at this. What? It's a bit spooky. Hey? It's a bit spooky in there. Look at that. It just goes dark. This is the best waterfall hike I've ever done. It's incredible. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey go Megan. It's awesome. It's awesome. <laughs> Look at this. Far out. I'm coming in. Oh gosh. No way. Oh, 
going the right way. Yeah, I saw a sign. Oh, are you okay? Yeah. Is it a big bit deep? Yeah. Yeah, maybe you shouldn't be down there. <laughs> we wanted adventure and we got it. I can't believe we just randomly picked this as our first waterfall. I know. This is nuts. And every, like we said, every single review on uh, Google Maps said that it is probably one of Bali's best kept hi hidden secrets. Do we go up there? Yeah. Or do we keep going? All right, we're lost. We're very lost. <laughs> Uh, this way looks better. Guys, just as we're walking through, we just had a thought. Is there pythons in Indonesia? Bali? We're going to have to... Because we're walking through the dark, darkest, most scariest <laughs> cave Jack decides to say, I wonder what kind of poisonous snakes are here. I wonder what kind of snakes are here. Leave a comment down below if anyone knows what kind of snakes are here because it'll be interesting to know. I think we do have to look out for leeches. Yes, well. we do have to look out for leeches. needs a van life shower. Go! Jump under it! <laughs> right under! That is right under! <laughs> no, no. Eww! If that hasn't made you want to come to Bali, guys, I don't know what will. I can't believe our luck that yep. that was our first waterfall. And it was <laughs> so incredible. lucky. And we had it all to ourselves as well. All to ourselves. We met the tour guide up the top there and he gave us some water and, <laughs> and we'll show him all the photos and videos we have on our phones of Australia and he was loving it. All right, we're going to get some food now. Oh, we've pulled into just any restaurant on the side of the road that has a sign like that and we're about to go in and see. I'm going to close the door. We are starving, so let's see what it's like. Looks good to me. So the meal we got came with a free iced tea. Let's so try that. It's not what you're expecting, eh? Oh, that's really good. Because I don't usually like the iced teas that you get, like from the no. servo or whatever. I don't like them, but that's really yummy. Excuse me, don't drink it all. Look at this. <laughs> we got some banana wrapped guarana fish, which looks amazing. Yeah. Oh my god, alright, look at it. Look at that. And Megan, it's gonna be spicy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, it's spicy. Is it? It's nice though. Yeah. And then we got we got some rice and I don't know what that is, tofu. I think it's tofu, yeah. Should I dip it? Mm-hmm. Fried tofu. Yum. That is amazing. With some sprouts and some rice. And then I don't know, I don't know what this is. Chicken. It's got bones in it. Oh, Look. cool. Yum. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be so good. That was amazing. Still going. <laughs> we absolutely demolished it. Look at that. All gone. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> what is going on? <laughs> We're just coming to like police everywhere, a huge festival with speakers the size of cars blaring. Look at all the traffic. That was intense. I wonder what it was. Look, here's another one. <laughs> that is so loud. Holy crap. I wonder what it is. Here, look, there's more, there's, oh, more. there's more. Look, look, ready, ready, ready. Oh, I don't know if I got my settings right. What are they doing? <laughs> what is going on? That was some crazy stuff. They all had like their big cars with their speakers and then they all had matching little uniforms for their cars. Did you see that? Yeah, I saw that. And, but there was like 50 people to a car all in matching little uniforms. I really hope that someone who actually knows what's going on is watching because I would love to know. Megan. <laughs> oh my god. Where? This is amazing. Yeah, you in toilet, yeah. I have in the dare. Oh, your okay. registration, right. uh, you ready here? Yeah. No problem, okay? Okay, thank okay. you. Registration, you pay uh, 60,000 per person. Oh, did uh, we already? Different. Oh, different. Uh, different. Uh, yeah, you just looking, oh, okay. picture, oh, go out. How yeah. far is registration? I might just drive there now. Ah, uh, you. Yeah, I'll come, and then I come back. Oh yeah, I'll yeah, come yeah. Come back yeah. here. So, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. we'll go registration. Yeah. All right. You we walk. You follow me. Yeah, I'll follow you. All right. So what we've done is we've paid thirty thousand to enter the area, and now we have to pay a th further sixty thousand. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. So that's what's that in Australian? Nine dollars. Yeah, nine bucks. It's not bad. That's mm -hmm. how much a national park costs in Australia. Yeah. So that's our camping spot. Wait till you see it, guys. Oh my gosh. The Balinese always rock up just when you need them. So he just was happening to come in as we were pulling in. And it's worked out perfect. Otherwise, we would have got lost, hey? Yeah, definitely. Oh my god. We've got full driving here. Ooh. There's a cow over there. <laughs> Cows everywhere. <laughs> wow. We are camping on the edge of a cliff tonight. And it's incredible. It's called Bukit Asar Campground. Oh, we'll put I'm going to say, I'm going to put it on the screen. But we're on, I think, the far east coast of Bali now. So we really have done sort of a half lap. Yeah. Because we've gone all the way up to the north and then all the way back around. Half lap of Bali. We've seen stuff that we probably wouldn't have seen if we didn't hire a car like this. Yeah. I've learned how to drive in Bali. <laughs> You've I'm, done so well, I can't I've done a good it. job. I, I'm gonna say I have done an exceptional job. We did have a few near misses this afternoon though, but. <laughs> <laughs> like this close. <laughs> We've made it to camp just in time for sunset. The wind is like picking up and down though, so I don't think we'll ever get to fully set up with the awning and everything, but we are gonna set up the fairy lights yes. and cook our own little two minute noodle dinner tonight. We got, we got bok choy. <laughs> What is it? Is that, is that bok choy? Yeah. Or Spring choy. onions, cabbage, what else? cabbage, and uh, we we'll use the seasoning from this these noodles, tom yum noodles, and uh, we we'll have dinner. Cute. Oh, I'm gonna miss Puku. We just named him like what he's already named, so we don't get too attached. So it's a him. Yeah, he's a him. I think he feels like a him. Classic. We'll see you in the morning, guys. Oh, they don't work. <laughs> You're kidding. No way. Do they? <laughs> Do they work? How come you got them? You got them on top of the roof. Yeah, I'm just trying to get them in first. Fairy lights are not working. We were very excited to use <laughs> these. Oh well. Oh well. Doesn't matter. The guy did them in front of us. He turned them on in front of us. Maybe we're just stupid. <laughs> <laughs> now we can't figure it out. <laughs>
Good morning. Good morning. Good morning from paradise. <laughs> you sound very chilled out. Yeah. <laughs> Coffee was good this morning. <laughs> so much sugar. Maybe it's the sugar kicking <laughs> and my body doesn't know what's going on. But guys, we woke up to like no wind and like hardly any clouds and it is stunning. And no people too. No, not one soul in sight. Look, just, just a couple, cows. couple of cows down there living the dream. But it's time for us to return our little Puku camper. We need to take Puku home. Although, I mean, it was so much fun, but I am desperate for a shower. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We forgot to bring towels. Yeah. So little secret, we haven't showered for three days. Mm. We've been now. Uh, baby wipe shower. Baby like wipe shower. Like old times eh? And if you've been to any parts of Asia at this time of the year, you'll know that it is humid and hot. So, I love it. Megan, you don't like, you love not showering. No, the humidity and the heat. <laughs> anyway, we're all packed up, so let's get going. Thank you very much. Yep. Home sweet home, guys. We made it. We ended up uh, dropping the camper van off and uh, made really good friends with the guy. So that was nice. Yeah, we had to wait a little while for our car to come, so yeah, we got we chatting. But we got a uh, Gojek mm -hmm. here to Ubud and we learnt that you do that one or grab yeah, car is on the an other. App. So yeah, it's actually really like easy. Uber. Yeah, but not. For Bali. Yeah. Um, but anyway, we have made it to what they call here a homestay. Yeah. Uh, we found it on Airbnb and it is so nice. It's beautiful. But we're going to leave you there because we really need a shower. Oh my god. <laughs> so badly. So yeah, we'll show you where we are and we're going to explore this area of where we are next yeah. episode. So if you want to see that, make sure you're subscribed. Also, if you're missing the troopy content, do us a favour or do yourself a favour and go and like us on Facebook because oh, yeah. we're doing all of our troopy content condensed yes. into like little six minute snack videos. sized videos so yep. um we hope you guys really enjoy that so go give us a like on facebook yep. if you're not already and we'll see you next time